Hey everyone, it's Melody. Welcome back to my channel and we are going to be over at the Disney California Adventure side today. And yes, we will be doing some pin trading. Today I am going to attempt to show you every single spot you can pin trade at California Adventure. We will see how many spots I get to. I will make sure that I shout them out to you so you know where to go to pin trade. So welcome if you're brand new to my channel. My name is Melody. I love making fun content about theme parks, travel, family, and of course, pin trading and Disney. Make sure to hit the thumbs up button if you like this kind of content. And if you have not subscribed, please hit the subscribe button. It really does help me out and I appreciate every single person who subscribed so far. So without further ado, let's go pin trade at Disney's California Adventure and I will show you every spot you can trade in or as many of the spots that I can get to today. All right, let's go. All right, I'm starting with my popcorn pins again. I still had a handful of these that I bought specifically to trade. I also have a few hidden Mickeys down here. I do have a few extra pins in my bags in case we find a lot more pins, but this is what we're starting with and let's see what we can find at Disney's California Adventure. Let's go. The first spot you can pin trade is called the Chamber of Commerce. It's on the left-hand side when you walk in, but there is a line, so I'm gonna try to come back to it later and let's see where else you can find. So Five and Dime sometimes has a pin trading spot. I do see a wheel here. So let's try the pin trading game. Hello, can I try the game? Yeah. All right, so we leave our pin here. Mm -hmm. Okay. Spin. Yellow. All right, I'm good with those. Thank you. I'm walking across the street on Buena Vista Street, and on Buena Vista Street, let's head to the Kingswell shop and see what we can find. Now, sometimes at the entrance, they do have a pin game here. I don't see it right now, but let's see if they have a board somewhere in here. Okay, I do see one of those mystery boxes here at the Kingswell shop. Choose, I'll choose hmm, 23 and uh, 13. All right, so here's 23 and you said which one, 14? Uh, or 13? 15. 15, okay. I'll change my mind. And then this Again. is 15. Awesome. All right. Thank you. We're good on those. You're very welcome. Thank you. All right. Connected to the shop I was just at is Trolley Treats. They have all sorts of sweet confections and I spotted Power Limes. I thought they only sold these at Disneyland at Toontown, but apparently they sell them right by the register at Trolley Treats. This is my favorite Disneyland candy. It is sour, tart, and yummy. All right, next spot that normally has a board is Elias and Company. Let's see if they have a board. And yes, I do see someone standing there. We'll see if there's anything good on the board. Hello, I just want to see the pin board. Oh, let me see yours too. Can I try for this one? Sure, it's a trivia. Okay, I'll try. Sure, uh, do you want a question trivia or a picture trivia? Uh, what was the choices? Question trivia or picture trivia? Uh, I've never done picture trivia picture before. Picture trivia is pretty much, I have a, a, a set of pictures of uh, villain sidekicks. You have to guess the names of them. Uh, I can try that. Can we do that? Sure. <laughs> That's cool. First time. I can still trade for some of the ones on here, right? Yeah, so yeah, like, yeah. Those okay. are regular trade. All right, because I like some of those, so. Let's try at the beginning. How many so do I? You have to get at least three, right? And you skip twice, okay? So the name goes... Floatsem uh, and Jetsem from uh, Ursula. Mr. Smee? Smee? Yeah, close. Smee? Yeah. Smee. Yeah. <laughs> Iago. Yeah, that's it. Oh, awesome. Oh, that's the one that I wanted to get. I'll see this. So, your choices is. This is your choice. Okay. Or, I have to be over here, too, as well. Let's choose if you want to. Let's see. I'll trade for this one for the trivia, and then I'll do two from the pouch. Cool. Thank you. <laughs> Next stop for pin trading is Cars Land. As soon as you step into Cars Land, it's a whole different vibe. Kind of got like a Western feel almost. It's got different decor. So every area slash land it just gives you a completely different feel, different type of energy. They have a snack bar here. I wonder if they have one at the snack bar. I'm gonna go find out. 
No pins at the snack area, but I have seen a pin board there before. So let's go to Sarge's Surplus Hut, which is the next stop. And they actually have a pin cone here. Uh, I'm just trying to see what pins that are on here. I was trying to see what was on the back of yours. Oh, you can see mine. I was like, well, what's on here? Oh, these ones are... Um, Those are stitched. They'll stitch, yeah, and then Those these ones. Those are cute. Yeah. Do you guys have any trivia pins today? I don't. All right, Radiator Springs is the next stop. Let's see what they have pin trading here. Might be at the front. I feel like there used to be one at the, the outside. All right, so there's a couple pins here, like Mini Plains Pool. Maybe the Olaf. I'm gonna check them out and see if we want to grab those. Let's go with the mini plane. Popcorn head. Still in Cars Land. We're gonna head on into Ramon's House of Body Art and see if they have a pin board in there. Santa car. All their holiday decor is in full swing. And I do see a board behind the register over there. So let's wait our turn and see what we can find. Here's the pin board piece. Do you guys have any trivia ones today? No. Not today. All right. Thank you. You're welcome. All right. Nothing there. Let's see where else we can go find some more pins. Back to the pen pound to see if there's anything new. Grab that hand she just put down on the side. Cute. Got this one. The popcorn Mickey head. Uh, thank you. So I went back to that pin cone as I was leaving Cars Land because it is on the way out. And the girl in front of me left this really cute like Mickey hand. So I went ahead and grabbed that at the pin cone at the Sarge's Surplus store. All right, we have walked down to Seaside Souvenirs. They used to have a pin board here. Not sure if they still do, but I will find out in just a second. Possibly on the other side. Let's see. Do you guys do pin trading here? Oh, we do. We have some oh. I would say All right, so we've got a cute little lighthouse thing here. It's kind of cute, but don't need that one. The use of a board, but they moved it to a little trinket here. Very cute. This spot that you might not know has a pin board. It's Boardwalk Pizza and Pasta. They normally have a pin board by the salad area. So if you walk in here, you can grab the salad or you can look at the pins. And I see it right there. So nothing for me today, but it's good to know that they have one here if you want to grab some lunch as well. So I'm going through the boardwalk. I'm actually going the opposite direction. I normally walk over here through. We're gonna pass the inside out ride and there should be a few pin trading spots here. Let's see if I can find them and let's see if I have better luck finding some good pins. Got a roller coaster up there. Anyway, Mercantile is next. So let's see if they have any pins in here. Normally they have a pouch of some sort. Let's see what we can find. I do see a barrel that the guy's holding. Go and look at the pins. Do you guys have any trivia ones today? No, not today. Okay, let me see. All right, thank you. Oh, actually, uh, I'll trade for that one, the fish one. Cross the boardwalk to Pan Pacific Pin Traders, and I want to see if they have a board here. I do see a board right here, which is a Big Hero 60s paper. Nothing on there, but they do have one here, and lots of pins for sale as well. The Redwood Creek Challenge Trail that my kids love doing is currently closed right now. However, when it is open, there is often someone standing right there with a pin board of some sort. So let's keep going. That's a bummer that they didn't have a pin board there, but we'll see what else we can find in this area. All right, that's really cool. The big bear is dressed in Christmas sweaters already. Here's the other bear. All the Christmas theme is out. And just to give you a reference, it is the beginning of November right now. I'm gonna see if they have a pin board here. Maybe it's on the inside. 
All right, I do spy one by the cash register. There's their pin board. I don't see anything that I want, but they do have a pin board in here. At the Humphreys Service and Supplies store, they have a pin board at the outside of the store. It looks like where they sell some Grizzly Peak refreshments. Let's see if there's anything good on there. Do you guys have any trivia pins? Trivia, I don't. Okay, thank you. All right, nothing on there for me today, but they do have a board here. I made my way to the other side of the park again, and we're now in Gone Hollywood. Once again, all the Christmas gear is up, and sometimes they have a board in front, sometimes it is on the side, and I see a board on the side. So let's see what we can find. Hello. Do you have any trivia pins today? Okay, thank you. Mm -hmm. I am bummed that Mickey's Fall Magic doesn't have a board anymore. They used to have a pretty big one. Now we're at the studio store. Let's see if they have a pin board. And I spot some pe people trading pins. So it looks like they do have a board. Are you in line? No. All right, I'll get the pins. Do you guys have any trivia pins today? I don't have any trivia ones. All right, today. thank you. So right behind that store, this is a little stage that Rodney actually performed at years ago. This is when we were first dating. I will try to uh, put a picture of or video of him performing here, but he performed on the piano with a choir that he was accompanying at California Adventure. We got, got to come in for free that day, so it was pretty cool. All right, Chamber of Commerce has no lines. I'm gonna take advantage and check out the pin board. Can I look at the pins, please? Do you have any trivia pins today? All right, you guys, I am here at the epicenter of Disneyland and California Adventure. I have left the park there. I went to every spot that I could find today that had pins. Let me know if I'm missing any. I hope you enjoyed following along on the pin trading journey. Let me show you the haul and then I will wrap up and hope to see you for another video soon. So here is my final haul from trading in every spot at California Adventure that I could find. I got some really cute pins. This Olaf one is the only one I'm not sure of if it's authentic, but I grabbed it anyway because it's cute. Uh, I love this like monsters one so I hope you guys are able to find this video useful and allow it to kind of guide you through different spots of Pinterest California Adventure some of these pins I found and they were not filmed because I went back to the same spots that I already filmed so like this little cat one figure out super cute but not a bad haul I was there for probably about an hour and a half I really raced around the park maybe two hours, but I wanted to try to film as many spots as possible for pin trading to give you guys ideas on where to trade. So that is all. Give this video a thumbs up. If you like pin trading content, make sure to subscribe and I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye.